and then I should be able to do that later. Uh, iron ore, which I'm kind of surprised I don't have being made. This seems weird. So we're going to take that out. Uh, maybe. X, motherfucker. Thank you. Oh. Well, there's that issue. And welcome back to the Drunken Gamer. Today, we are drinking... Oh, of course, it makes it disappear. Gotta put it in front of my face. This is not probably margarita. It is margarita. <laughs> it's a Gatorade margarita. Because it's just flavorful and hydrate while you dehydrate it. It's fucking great. As you can see, we're playing some Dyson Sphere pro uh, Project. Program. Dyson Sphere program, and I just got my splitter, uh, which is nice, and also updated things and a traffic monitor. We're about to monitor the real time cargo flow rate at the corresponding location. Conditions can be set to trigger an alarm. Apparently, the game's been updated since I played. What the fuck is that thing for? I guess just an alert if you're running out of stuff. I mean, I can see its usefulness, but probably not going to need it for a while. So. We still got all our spaghetti belts, but okay. So the other thing I'm gonna have a problem with. Uh, where's the grid? No, that's not what I want. There we go. Uh, we're pretty close to the equator already, aren't we? Fuck. Well, let me zoom out. Apparently not. Other fucker. Um, fuck. Well, shit. Where's... I wanted to save the equator for the... For the thingies. How do I... I it's been a while since I played this game, so I'm a little rusty. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Statistics, make, uh, replicator, inventory, detail display. I don't think that's what I want. How do I zoom out? I thought I just scrolled. What happens if I click over here? That'll work. Yeah, we're pretty much right on the equator. Fuck. The belt's not supposed to be on the equator. The, the the thingies are supposed to be on the equator. What the fuck was I thinking? And I don't know why. But go back to thank you. Fuck. Hmm. So that bold line there is probably the equator. Where's my Yep, see? Zero right there. Bam. And that way is not. Yeah. So this band. Do I. Can I build those yet? Power, power, power. I can build these. Which is okay because. Need foundation support. Fuck off. And then the closest I can build that. Collide with the other object. Motherfucker! Well, let's go over here just so we can see our range. So, stick this thing there. And we want the next one. Damn it! Uh, F? Is that fabricator? Yes, it is. Uh, so, yeah, this is starting out wonderful. Uh, I forgot how to land. Alt! Alt lands. Just so you know. We need some more of these. E? Yes. We'll snag a few of these fuckers. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, it, uh, fuck, whatever. And two. Let's build ten to... I can only build two. Whatever. Build those two. I just needed to... Get to... Uh, give me my grid back. Not that it really matters. Do, 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 do. Okay. So that is, and you need for the instant support. Fuck off. And I can't terraform yet. Whoa, wrong button. So we need to move our entire belt system off of this equator. 
So I'm going to have to like redo this whole fucking thing because this all area should be like both sides of the equator kind of like to this far uh, need to that far over there is going to be for a belt of solar and wind farm and that tends to power my planet for quite a while. So what the fuck? Huh. So the question is, do I just like wipe all of them out and move it over? Yeah, I probably should, huh? And I need, I need some foundation. What do I need to get? How do I get to science? Fuck, I forgot how to play this damn game. Is it this one? Here, just click on that. There we go. I need foundations, foundations, found ah, that one. I need you. Activate. 400. Fuck. So. Uh, fabrication. I can produce nothing. So I need 400 of these and 400 of those. So I guess just collect them from the belts until I have 400. So I'll be right back after I collect these 400. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to be back after I produce the 400. So yeah, I'll be back. Alrighty, I'm back. And as you can see, I am researching. I've got... Where is my thingy? Um... I created all 400 of these, and apparently they automatically just disappear when they're getting used. So, they're uh, researching, and I'll have splitters, which means I do actually need more space between the... Wait, I've already got splitters. What am I researching? Researching the terraforming. Right, 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 right. Um, but the splitters, as you can see, you can't just stick these belts next to each other and use a splitter. So, they need to be spaced every three be able to stick splitters in every now and then and which means all of this needs to go anyway so what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to dismantle all of this uh i don't want to dismantle that guy because yeah uh or that um can i not dismantle an area what is this uh what's this Hold shift, chain dismantle. Alright, well that works I guess. I thought I would just like send my peep, my little robots after all this. So all of this is going away. Yeah, that's even on a different grid. And... Uh, yes. Delete all of you, delete all of you. Where is the... Where was iron being made? Is it iron not being made there? What's over here? If I... Okay. What? No, no, no. Okay. Uh, stop dismantling because I don't want to accidentally fuck up shit. So... Uh, this thing. Whoa. Yeah. Let's... One, two, three. Uh, we'll stick that. And... What is my shortcut to that? C. Character. Makes sense, right? Are you going to keep eating these? Nope. Okay, so you need to go that there. Eat the coal first. And why do I have iron ore in me? Uh, you take all the coal. Can you take these last 14? Nope. Uh, and I can't put it in there either. So what I should do, think, block that one off. And then I should be able to do that later. Uh, iron ore, which I'm kind of surprised I don't have being made. This seems weird. So we're going to take that out. Uh, maybe. X, motherfucker. Thank you. Oh. Well, there's that issue. Um, I need a smelter. Smelter. And then... The just sticks this to this. No connection. Wait, what did that say? Did that say too close? Why? You? To there. Too close. Ah! Just so I can have some production in while I'm figuring everything else out. I'm wanting to get some of these built. So it's making things for now. Uh, and then... 
Uh, you're probably too close. Let's find out. Yeah. I don't know why. Away. Uh, storage will stick you here. And... Voila. Okay. And you will be making iron bars. And now we need to get power in here. So we'll just stick you in there. Is that good? Do we have enough power for everything? Those are power facilities. Uh, plenty. Okay, good. So, at least in the meantime, I will also have iron ore being produced. Uh, iron plates. And so I'm actually going to wipe out all of these. For now. Yeah, including that thing. Yeah. So, just filling these, which is over. That one's obviously already full. Uh, okay, that makes some sense, I guess. Maybe a little. You be quiet. Research too slow. You, I'm doing it manually. Give me a break. And, oh, I got a lot of steel. So now I got a whole bunch of, like, base items. Oh, you need to go in here. Because I don't want to carry ore randomly. Okay. So, I'm going to now block off. Do I have, how many of these do I have? I have four. So, this to there. Uh, I think this one's colliding with it. Let's see. And when I get solar, there. Okay. So, that is the, the base size There. There. And I don't have one. Because I need I need one more of these things. Can I build at least one? Uh, you know, no, I just want one right now. And we'll we'll deal with the other stuff later. Still building seven of those. And then we'll in inside two uh the what is the science thing? T two of the solar panels should fit right in between those just right uh, I'm not sure what gives me solar panels oh look I get environmental modification now I've got to make concrete uh, I'll figure that out in a minute uh, where are the solar panels is there a search thing planetary logistics probably not that far up needed Titanium smelting doesn't give it to us. Energy storage. No, that would be good, but probably before then. Solar collection. Those things. So, solar panels, which is actually next, so maybe we can activate that. And can I fabricate 200 of those? I can. Sweet. We're going to do that. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, no, 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 too far. Uh, how do we, how do we... How many do I have? Two, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's a hundred. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. And I had two built, so I should be able to just do eight, and that should be the right amount. We'll find out, I guess. Close enough. And then we can put solar panels in between these, and that will be our belt on the equator. Um, obviously, these will fix, and as soon as I get all of... Is that? Yeah, that is eating all of those. Cool. And how long is that going to take? There's 63,000 in there. Um, yeah, I will probably need to make more of that. Uh, what is this? Gathering you. Let's... Uh, uh, let's get you there now if we have a few of these munching on this i mean right now it's not going to make a whole lot of difference because as you can see even the one is not being utilized constantly but when i do actually start burning through more of these and and smelting more into iron and stuff having all four of these will eat through this this node faster um I, how, what does it take to make concrete foundation i need stone and steel oh fuck this is expensive this is going to take a while to get get this equator done 
But that means we can... This is a terrible starting area. There's a lot of water here. There's like no consistent area for belts. So if we like try and start a fabrication system here, having the belt running across. Huh. This sucks because there's, there's way too much water on this damn planet. I mean, look at this. This thing is like all water. There's like little islands and massive amounts of water. I want oceans and continents, fuckers. Not islands and archipelagos. Um, how do I cancel out of that? It's nighttime. So, I guess I will kind of rebuild that whole thing that I just had and destroyed. Uh, but up here, off of the equator, because I don't know what I was thinking and building it on the equator when I knew I was going to use that as a belt for solar and wind power. And I guess I'll be back. Or what time is it? 15 minutes in? Yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> we'll see how we get there. Um, you'll see the end result, because, yeah, you've seen me build it before. It's a lot of the same, but now you'll see the finished product. Alright, just to give you guys a heads up of what's going on um i have reconstituted this whole area back here reconstituted is that the right word reconfigured reconfigured the area back here uh we got four miners on each of these um nodes mining deposits and they each run two belts over to some smelting and then the smelting produces iron and copper plates I will probably need to get some magnets, which is going to be straight iron ore as well. So I'll have to figure that out later. Um, and then just a couple of storage units just to have some extra plates stored here and then going on. And this is new, the new belt system. They are spaced at least one apart because then, as you can see, I can stick one of these in the middle. And then ultimately, if I do need to stick one like over here like a splitter right here I need to run under. I will just adjust this belt to go up and over the other belt by a half step. Um, and when we get to that point, you'll you'll see how that's done. Um, half steps are nice and a convenient. It's a kind of like a little hack that you do to make it go up and over half a step instead of a whole step. Uh, but then also, as you can see, this is going up and over the equator belt that will eventually fill this area. Uh, hopefully I got that configured enough correctly, because if I don't, I'm going to have to move all these smelting, which will suck. But we'll get to that point when we get when we reach it. Uh, I need a lot more. I need to have a silicon section built, uh, be processing stone into silicon, uh, which is to make silicon ore, you need 10 stone. It's expensive to build on this home planet. Um, eventually we can go out to, there's another planet nearby that will have a lot actual silicon deposits and we can, we can get more silicon that way, but that's, that's going to be later down the road. So this is where I'm at so far. Uh, it's been quite a bit of time. Uh, not all of it was been building. I've been kind of distracted by a few things and some phone calls and whatnot, but uh, this is kind of how I just wanted to give you guys a heads up and probably end the. Oh fuck! It's only eighteen minutes. Yeah, we'll probably end the end the episode here shortly. Um, but this is expandable, as you can see. There's two lines coming in, and then each of these smelters can pull from either of the line. I know. I think one line usually supports only six smelters, so this way I can get 12 out of two lines, but if one line falls a little short, they can pull from the other line, so it kind of balances out pretty well. If I remember correctly, if I'm actually using all of this iron, which I'm not right now, these two lines will support these 12, but not anymore. I'm not certain on that. Um, my math might be wrong. I might be remembering correctly, and I'm mixing games. It's a very possibility. I don't know. But we'll find out in the future. Um, eventually, we'll we'll have a much larger smelting facility. We'll also have a lot more ore coming in. Basically, we'll use the planetary hubs, is what I think they're called. Uh, 
Is it these things? No. Planetary logistics systems. So we'll use these planetary logistics systems. We'll basically pump, you know, wherever we're mining ore, we'll just throw into one of these and they'll all come out to one big smelting area. It'll be great. And then we can eventually have an interstellar logistics system, which allows us to go to other planets. So that's a ways into the future. And in fact, as you, and as you can see, I'm starting my equator belt. When I researched the solar panels, it gave me one, but to get more, I need silicon, which is expensive. Like, really expensive. Ten freaking stone for one silicon ore, and then I can turn a silicon ore into a silicon... I need two silicon ore, so 20 stone to make each one of these uh, high-purity silicon... Silicon? Whatever. Uh, devices, and I need ten of those... To make one solar panel so 20 stone per one solar panel it's gonna be a while I'm gonna need some more stone deposits uh, and this is currently my only stone deposit I've got a lot of coal what is that over there there's some more stone there so I have other options eventually I can get some more of this stone there's some more iron over there but and then obviously I could just go mine, manually mine all this other stone out here um, and then I'll just shove it in that box, which, and I've also got some silicone, silicon back here, that, from mining, I've got silicon, titanium, a little bit of iron, why is that in there? Let's pull that iron out of there, because there's no reason for that shit to be in there. Um, and we'll just go stick it, well, fuck, I don't have an iron depository yet, so we'll just throw it in one of these for now but um yeah i just wanted to give you guys a heads up and we'll end the episode here i am working and i've got one thing i've got my iron but so just to show you branch it off stick it here i got some gears and i can put more gear uh, assembly machines out this way up to however many it ends up taking looks like it's one iron ingot to one gear is it a one for one ratio one iron ingot to one gear okay and it takes one second so and i believe these are a 30 six cargo per second okay so it, it would only be able to hold or supply six of these machines so if i put three on each side have them come together and that'll make a, the, a full belt that way. Right now, I've only got one because, it, it, you know, obviously I'm not using them right now. Eventually, I'll do the same thing with other things. I'll branch them off, stick them here, and then the whole bus is going to be every other thing. So, unlike Factorio, like Factorio, you can have them a lot closer together and it's easier to split things off and you can go underground belts and whatnot. This it requires a lot more space um satisfactory was similar in that way it just takes a lot of more space however this is universal versus just one planet year on multiple planets so eventually it, it, it balances out um so yeah but until next time folks drink responsibly